Hola, it's Ben Molly. Welcome to the channel. Today we're watching episode 5 of season 6 of The Walking Dead. Um, I just filmed the last one. It was a good one. It was a very good episode. Um, it made me understand Morgan a lot more, so I enjoyed it. But this episode, I don't know what's going to happen. I think at the end of the last one, we heard Rick say open the door, so he's going to see the aftermath. So we'll see what happens. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction from me. Thank you so much for watching, and let's just get into it. Oh, and Michonne and Michonne and those two other guys. She looks empty, like her eyes. All the walkers. <laughs> She's like, you set them all here. Oh, she probably hates him, man. Go, hurry, hurry, hurry. Go, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Damn, he ran all the way here. They should have, you know, killed some, you know? <laughs> Oh wow, you know, a lot of people survived. I thought a lot of the extras died. <laughs> They're all gonna blame it on Rick for sure. Some of you saw it. They got back here. Half of them. Still enough to surround us 20 deep. We try to make this place as quiet as a graveyard. See if they move. This place is a graveyard. Quarry broke open and those walkers were heading this way all of them the plan that rick put into place stopped that from happening we got half of them away erin i was i can't even make two meals out of this Soups and sauces can be stretched out with some extra water. What difference does that make if we'll be dead tomorrow? We have to ration okay. now. I can't spend whatever time I have left watching my family starve. Wait! I'm sorry. Uh, you don't even know, oh my god, like, how they starved out there. You know what, these people remind me of those people that hoarded the toilet paper. <laughs> These people are selfish. We need to make it last if we're gonna survive. Why don't you go make sure the gate's closed, Spencer? And then we'll all look back at this moment right These now. are all Karens, okay? So Karens. <laughs> selfish. Oh, Adrian. Adrian? No, Aiden. Glenn. Oh, Aaron. Oh my I know a safer way out. She's drawing the roads or something. Education training. Expansion. Dolor Divide properties of them. What did that even mean? <laughs> Are these the plans? Just came from the pantry. Oh, he took. You you stole it? I wouldn't call it that. This guy, he told the other people, "Don't be selfish." Yet. Told everyone. <laughs> he was trying to say something for himself. That was just bullshit. Saw it, then that would be the end. But one 
person. One person and no one ever would know. Oh, man. Now that is some bullshit. You're the reason we're so screwed. You made us this way. We were never safe here. But you didn't want to see that. You didn't want us to see that. You just wanted to dream. What happened to Dad, to Aiden? That's all you. And you were happy living this little dream. It's not. Jesus. She was doing it. Of course. You know, she should have prepared more, but it's not all on her. There's so much pressure on this girl. <laughs> I get that um, Tara's only trying to help her, give her confidence, boost her. I don't recognize her. people <laughs> that's a nasty one how do you even get under there ah! come on come on come on come on come on come on don't die This is why you never go by yourself. If Mackie was here on her own. Yes. She's there for you. I could have done it. I don't know about that. How is he? <laughs> I saved him. <gasps> that was very <laughs> unexpected. That was very cute. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. The way she's so shy. Oh my gosh. I'll guard his last picture of me. Because I said it wasn't gonna need it anymore. Because I was never gonna be away from him again. I'm frightened. He didn't want me to go out there. And I said yes. And if I would have gone. If I was with him. Maybe I could have helped him. I don't know if he's alive. He would have shown me by now. That's what Michonne said. I don't get to know what will happen. I don't get to know why it happened, what I did right or wrong. Not now. I have to live with that. You do too. The show is killing me. Oh, gosh. 
You gotta get him in the head. She's so small. Oh, look at her now, man. She looks just like Rick when she was he was beating up Pete. He was telling you from the start, Dean. <laughs> I feel so bad for her. I knew from her, her and her husband, they wanted everything for this place, for their kids, for everyone. And seeing it go down like this, oh, it must hurt so much. What is she going to do? Is she going to open the gate? Girl, you're making too much noise. Is that it's blood? Is it seeping through? Okay, guys, this episode we got to kind of like not closure, but like things here and there kind of wrapped up. I don't know if Glenn, Glenn if Maggie's still gonna go look for Glenn because at, at the well that she, she and Aaron it kind of sounded like she thinks she doesn't deserve to see him again or something like that. But she's gonna live through the pain of not knowing if he survived or not. Honestly, I don't. I really don't want her to go. Anyways, I don't want her to see this. Oh my gosh, he's probably. Oh my god. Oh my god. What did they meet as like a walker? Like he's a walker? Cause. But anyways, I've been talking too much. I hope you guys enjoy this reaction from me. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.